Hello viewers, it's uh, Sunday, 26th of July. Uh, this is a development match between Sanderstead and Beddington. Beddington batting there, 81 for three, and this is the 23rd over. Oh, Matt Harris, <laughs> typical, typical form lets that go through his legs, and why not? Lucy's seen it all. Luke McDowell bowling from our under 15s, and he's, he's transformed himself into a leg spin bowler just for this season, or just back started, up, and uh, yeah, it's making a promising start actually. Gets good loop and a little bit of tweak. And right, we went the other way. Here we go, 92 for three, 24 overs gone. Lucy continues, he's got the one wicket. Blimey. Oh, Lukey. So, uh, Jake, well, I've got you here, mate. Jake Scarisbrick. Um, yeah. What's your favourite chocolate bar? Um, dairy milk caramel. Dairy milk caramel? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, can't beat that. Okay, um, interesting. With the milk as well. With, with milk, yeah. Well, me and Cy were saying yesterday that, no, me and Rusty actually, saying yesterday that a uh, Whisper bar out of the fridge with a nice, nice no, glass of cool milk. I'm not, I'm not a fridge chocolate. Really? No, no, uh. I like it a bit more like gooey. Really? Because then it goes down nice with the milk. Yeah. Okay, uh, interesting, interesting. Oh, well. Anyway, thanks for that. And that's a great catch from J-Lo, Johnny Longcock. That's two now for Lucy. She's uh, been hit about a bit. Uh, you moon ball full tosses, but uh, but you know, getting the wicket, so all good. Ah, bit of dog on pitch action there. 14 weeks old, that dog, little French bulldog. That's uh, Joe Baldwin, the wicket keeper. That's his dad there taking dog off the pitch. Oh, ball. Well, we've got rain here. This wasn't forecast. Um, hopefully, it's just a passing shower, but uh, it really is raining hard. Look at that from Matt Harris. Wow. Well, I'm delighted to be joined by uh, three of the codgers. Uh, I've got Bob Locke, Ned Bridges, and Bob Holland. So, uh, Bob, we'll start with you. Whilst that goes away for four. Bob, what's your favourite chocolate bar, mate? I don't mind, Dan. Whatever you've got, I'll have it. <laughs> <laughs> it's funny, I asked the same question to uh, Johnny yesterday, and uh, he said that's tough. It's a bit like being asked to choose your favourite child. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's got to be a double decker. Double decker oh, or a whisper. We, are we allowed the same? Bold Lucy. Double decker or whisper? Yeah, we had, uh, yeah I'm, I'm a whisper man. I'm Johnny Johnny chose double decker, actually. I'm a Ned. double decker. You're a double decker? It's, it's crunchy, yeah. yet chewy. Yeah. Are you ever done double like decker that. in the fridge? Yes, yeah. oh, you yeah. can break your teeth, but it's tree. Do you remember um, Willie Rushton? Yes. He used to do the advert for Double Decker yeah. on the telly. Is that right? Yeah. I, I don't remember he that. He was the one, they're crunchy yet chewy. Yeah. That beard, Ned, you're actually starting to look like Willie Rushton. <laughs> yeah, I'll go for it. I'm just not as funny. <laughs> oh dear. All right, what, what fun, what fun. Let's have a little cocktail. Wow. Yeah. It's actually, it's actually some sort of dodgy website as well, I think. <laughs> Ooh. That, that full toss is lethal. <laughs> what, fries Turkish Delight? Yeah, that's it. Fries Turkish Delight. Yeah, fries. never a fan of Turkish Delight. No, not no, most of It's wrong on every level. No, it's it is wrong. It's not, not as wrong as Bounty, though. Someone mentioned Bounty. Well, you've got to... You've, you've got to Differentiate your bounties, Dan. Your, your standard milk chocolate bounty, I agree, rubbish. Yeah. Plain right. chocolate bounties, now you're talking. Okay, it's a completely okay. Different thing. Interesting. Viewers, what do you think? So, Bob, Bob Longcock, you've got an important announcement, haven't you, mate? Yes, I have. Um, so, the Sunday development team, we are looking for 
uh, volunteers from the subscribers and the viewers. Uh, we're looking for an umpire and a scorer for the Sunday development team. So if you're in the area uh, and you fancy having a go at umpiring or scoring, uh, do get in touch. Excellent. Thank you, Bob. Any particular skills necessary? Oh, hello. Blimey. Ouch. Probably the ability to be able to call a no ball for a headhunter. <laughs> <laughs> Excellent. Which, of course, the Archbishop seems to have there. Very good. Nice. Well, there's Bob Longcock, Ned Bridges, just moving a boundary board. Trying to nick it, I don't know. I think it's a Black Knight Bats, which uh, Bob runs with Johnny. There we are, Black Knight Bats, on the move. Magnificent. Zane Chow joins the attack. Oh, and that's a, that's a big old four wides. I've uh, got Matt Harris with me. Matt, what's your favourite chocolate bar, mate? I like a flake. Do you? Yeah. Yeah, I always thought you were a bit flaky. Yeah. Well, Performance-wise, <laughs> I am today. <laughs> well, no, you, 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 you know, you'll, you'll get better. Yeah. <laughs> Brilliant. That's better. Well, the score's moved on to 131 for four. This is the 32nd over. Johnny Longcock into the attack. Oh, little edge. That's going to go for four again. Well, that's a nice shot. Lovely shot. I'm sure Bob knows what he's doing and Ned, but, um, you know, they've, they've put the Black Knight bats board in a rather strange position, not going to get noticed much there. Maybe it's some sort of subliminal marketing concept. Well that's the 150 up for four, it's the 35th over. That's a lovely shot, won't go. Going for three. Anyway, Jake Scarisbick's on now and uh, bowling an interesting blend of right arm round filth. And why not? Oh my word, double bouncer. I don't think the Archbishop knows what to signal here. Ah, oh, there we go. That is a free hit. Could be a run out. Ooh. Jake, don't need it. Poor ball, probably deserved. Take a rest there, Jake. Take a rest there. 50 there. 160 for four. Just the four overs left now. That was pretty good to me, and that's it. I think the batsman walked. Um, what bowled there from Matt? Goodness, straight. That's five down, 161, I think. Two and a half overs left. Right, just the ten balls left. Um, I thought Bennington should be looking to look to get on with it a bit. There's all sorts of all sorts of shenanigans going on out there. One run was the result. Nice flight. Ooh. And that hits the batsman. Last over. Oh, that's got to be close as well. But Probably drifting down. Good work from Jake there. And oh, didn't get the run out. And well, this is going to be an interesting. Uh, <laughs> well, it's an absolute demolition of the stumps there. Um, <laughs> 
Well, uh, <laughs> seen it all now. Um, I've got, he's not allowed to touch the stumps, which is interesting with COVID, but, um, but obviously in the heat of the moment, you do what you need to do. And Well, very interesting. That's it, that's 174 to win. So I'm we've got to get off 40 overs. And Here we go, 174 is the target to get off 40 overs. Tyler Ward, Jake Scarisbeck opening the batting. Following on from their fine 50 partnership in the uh, first ever game yesterday. Over the top. Won't go. So I've got Lucy with me. Uh, we'll bowl today, Lucy. A couple of wickets. Well, that's a lovely shot from T, and that's uh, just bounces short. And there's Sam Owen. Still got it. Still got it. Yeah, no, well done. Um, anyway, enough of that. What's your favourite chocolate bar? Um, you might not have heard of it, but it's called Marvellous Creations. It's a type of dairy milk bar, mm. but it's like it's got like sweets in it, and it's really good. Yeah, cool. No, I haven't come across that. That's a new one. Yeah. Oh, and that is a glorious shot. Absolutely marvellous. Jerry Ward there, father of Tyler, striding back to his. Market square leg with a real purpose. Excellent servant of the club, Jerry. Empire scores. Skipped a few sides. Did Sunday team for a long time. That's a lovely shot from Tyler. Straight through extra cover. There she goes. Beautifully signaled by the Archbishop. There we go. It's a steady start for Sardisir. Jake's gone aerial, and that's just gonna. Ooh, don't know if that made it or not. No, just dropped short. Oh, looks like a bit of bit of leg spin coming into the attack. Perfect for Sunday afternoon. And Tyler, nice little reverse lap, and that's four runs. That's a nice shot. Should go. There it is. Well, that's a 50 partnership brought up for these two, and that's a lovely, lovely shot. One bounce into the screen. Yeah, I think that's something like their fifth consecutive 50 partnership. These two really, really love batting together. That's over the top. Oh, and that's, um, that's a big one. Well, a shout out to um, Ed Lucking and the lads. At, that's a lovely shot from T over extra cover. It's plugged though. Um, yeah, Wivenhoe Cricket Club, Ed Lucking. Thanks very much, guys, um, for uh, well, basically sending us sending us some beer vouchers via a thing called Ko-Fi. Uh, there's a link below if anyone else wants to buy us a beer. No pressure, you don't have to. Some people want to though. So, oh, Wyvern Town, uh, out there in Colchester, I believe, in Essex. Uh, hope the season's going well for you. I need to run for that one. Oh, nice one from Jake. That's uh, middle that for four. Ah, shot T. Didn't get all of that though. No matter. Oh. So these two rattling along now. That's um, what is that? That's some no, it's going to be 94 now. I think this is the 15th over. Well, these two obviously will be looking for a hundred partnership. I wonder if they've had one of those before. Ah. Oh, that could be. That's a kiss of death on that one. I think. Yes, there we go. That's uh, Jake goes. 
I think that's a 95 partnership. Well batted Jake. Keeps his early form this season going very nicely. Joe Baldwin, wicket keeper, joins Tyler. And he's off the mark straight away. Oh, shot, Tyler. That's uh, pierced the gap beautifully. Oh, that's got to go. And it does. Oh, that's tremendous double clang there. Yes, that's a lovely shot. It's a six. Ah, and that's 50 for Tyler. Well, Sandra said making light work really of this of this chase. Um, yeah, just a little shout out there for Farley, Farley Golf Club. Uh, excellent place to play golf. Us codgers play there all the time. Uh, yeah, so you're in the area, fancy a round of golf on a really good course, then go to Farley. Link below. So skip today, Johnny, Johnny Longcock, after saying yesterday Double Decker was his favourite chalk bar, he's rocked up with a Twix, what's that about? I got it from the bar down there. You're being it's, unfaithful. I am being unfaithful, <laughs> it's killing me inside, but um, one of those that you've got, got to do what it's got to do. Yeah, fair enough, fair enough. Ooh, similar, it's a bit, a bit of chewy stuff on the Yeah, inside. I guess so, yeah. And uh, we don't have Double Deckers here, do yeah, we? Yeah, I know. Someone said invest, please. Oh, and that's <laughs> juggled. Third attempt. Bye, Joe Baldwin goes. No, oh, sorry. Tyler goes. Oh, I'm really. <laughs> yeah, really. Yeah, <laughs> not good. It's alright. <laughs> <Not on board. laughs> oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, I'm losing it. Shot, Bane. Shot, Bane. the four there. What played Zane? Will you in? Oh, that's a nice looking shot. Ooh. 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 Tremendous effort there. Unlucky, that really uh, well, I think that deserved to be out, but hey ho, Zane gets, uh, gets a life there. What have we got? Something like 40 to win, 20 overs left to, left to get them in. Oh, Zane chips one up, and he's gone. <laughs> what is he doing? So that's now Sonny Reese here at five, and uh, oh, when he gets going, he can hit a long ball, so... Oh, let's put him down. Tough chance. Good effort. Good effort. Well, T's just turned up. What about it, mate? How much you get? Um, sixty odd, maybe something like that. Yeah, yeah. Not, not the toughest bowling attack, but you know, no, still got to get fun. the runs. Hopefully, it leaves the youngsters to finish it off. Well, let's hope so. Yeah, that's the that's the whole point of this. So, uh, what's your favourite chalk bar? I love a Snickers, Dan. Do you? Yeah, yeah quite Snickers. a popular call yesterday, actually. Was it? Yeah. Yeah, you yeah. can see why. Yeah, um, I think Cy was, was it Cy on for Snickers? Um, Dev, yeah. Delicious. Yeah, very, de very delicious. Well, just 20 to win now, all the time in the world, and uh, ah, Sonny's just, just hit a couple of boundaries and he's starting to go for it. But ah, that's a good ball there. It's never over till it's over. Oh well, there's a big gap down there, and that's really well struck from Sonny. Oh, and he emerges from the hedge, and he's down. <laughs> wow. Superb ball hunting there. Oh, that's 15 needed now. Off 14 overs. That was a nice late cut for four from Joe. So, quick single there. Oops. Little snick and everything's running away today down there. Balls going into the hedge, people going into the hedge. Six to win now. Joe's just glanced at the scoreboard, can you see that? Is he going to finish it in style? Come on Joe. Well, that was stylish. And a bye brings Sonny on to strike. Come on, Sonny, have a go. And well, that's four. No need to 
No need to run for that one. Just a two to win now, or is it one maybe? Yeah. Ah, one to win, Phil comes in. And there we go. That's uh, a very, very, very comfortable victory. Asana said there, winning by um, seven wickets with uh, good, a good 12, 15 overs to spare. A round of applause. Um, yeah, I think we'll probably finish off the evening by having a couple of pilgrims. And why not?